Hello there fellow Hrot enthusiasts. Today I will show you how to mod Hrot. It's a pretty simple process, but uh, yeah, I will show you basically. First thing you need to do is uh, open your Steam, you will see your games uh, and you will go right click, browse local files. It will open this window, which uh, is your just Hrot related things. And uh, for this, we'll need a uh, modding tool, which is from Reddit, made by a user called, I forgot his name, but he's, it's, it's very impressive. And I will link it in the description, you can download it there. Next, you will download the file uh, and the zip file. And you can either copy it or blah, blah, blah. Paste it here in your uh, directory and uh, just extract it here. Boom, you can delete this if you want. And now we need to decompile Hrot, Hrot basically. And uh, first thing is setup. And then you go unpack, not bad. Basically, yeah, it, it uh, decompiles the game. Then you will need to create, this is very, very important. We want to create a text file called patch dash exe and make it a bad file as you can see it's it's here uh, may, uh, sometimes uh, windows doesn't want to convert uh, text files into these bad files and if uh, it doesn't change the icon doesn't change you, you will go to view and uh, check file name extensions and it'll see you it will show you these extensions sometimes happens that uh, it's patch uh, exe bad dot d, d, txt which is not what you want you want this bad file and uh yeah you will then go to this uh, repack that bad you will open it uh, in your notepad it uh, doesn't really matter and you will copy these two things one is this we will open this patch dot exe there we go. You can open it in Notepad++. Plus plus. It doesn't really matter. I will open it here just for the sake of it. Boom. You can see. I can. And then copy this last line into another. There we go. One also very important thing is that the size of the original pack file, which is basically what Herod contains, uh, data, blah, blah, blah. Uh, you need to go to properties and copy the size not this size on disk but size size itself you will copy this number and you will paste it instead of this number here don't forget to remove these dots and save the file now uh, the thing is every time Herod updates you will need to you will need to uh, change this again because uh, otherwise the mod won't work uh, the size needs to be exactly how big is it now because uh, as you could see before the size of it was uh, an old very old version because this m tool was made like a year ago so yeah now i will grab my my first of all i will delete this because I don't need it anymore. The game wouldn't start now. But when you when I grab this and I put it in here, it's my it's my thing I made. And then you will need to launch patch dash exe dot bad. Okay, now it worked, it, it didn't work for a second. Then you will just start the game. As you can see, I have custom font here and, uh, and we can wait until the game loads. As you can see, uh, it's my custom custom font. Uh, you as Also, I have some custom sounds. Let us, for example, Quake Grenade. So yeah, now you can mod Hrot, you can install mods and stuff. 
So yeah, I hope this was helpful. And uh, see you later. Lol.